one, the increasing number of councils of all political persuasions that are opposed to the closure of railway ticket, office, ticket offices, including, for example, Roxbourne, Hertfordshire, Worcestershire, Luton, Leicestershire, Reading, Warrington, Southwark, Nottingham City Council, Mole Valley, Worthing, North East Lincolnshire, East Yorkshire, South Gloucestershire, I could in fact go on. And two, that over 3,000 local people signed a Harlow and Save Our Ticket Office petition and hundreds responded to a postcard campaign. Will the leader of the council now condemn the proposed closure of Harlow's railway ticket office and publicly call for it to remain open? Thank you, Councillor Lucas. Councillor Sorts. As I responded to Councillor Lucas last week, I absolutely share the concerns raised by many residents, particularly vulnerable and disabled residents, and I've written to Grace Brown to raise these concerns for me. I'll share this letter with Councillor Lucas, uh, sorry, Councillor Edwards and Councillor Lucas tomorrow. Thank you very much, Councillor Sorts. Councillor Edwards, do you have a supplementary? I do. You can do so. And given that you have written a letter, um, will you show some respect to both the council, to the members of the public here, and to, and to the press by sharing the content of that letter and what, you're, what it is you're saying, whether or not you are formally, uh, uh, formally asking for the ticket office to remain open, will you share that with us publicly tonight? Thank you very much, Councillor Lewis. I, I think there's a councillor attempting to attract my attention to a possible point of order. Is that no, not okay? Point of order, no. no? Okay. Councillor Sword, please continue. Uh, as I said, I'll share the letter with him tomorrow. I'm more than happy to make that public as well. 